Hello everybody and welcome to Trailmakers. Today I think I want to build a helicopter, so let's do that. First step, seat. Alright, we're gonna want to put in some box there. I'll worry about the back end of the helicopter later. That like that. Okay, so this one's gonna be the forward going one. This one's gonna be the backward going one. See, no torque generated. So that is a good sign. That is what we want to happen. Let's use grid blocks for this part. Yeah, nah. And then we do those. A little bit of that. Oh. Cool. Now gotta add the same thing to the bottom. Hmm, that's a bit too symmetrical. Ah. Perfect. Looks great so far. Now we're gonna probably want to add some landing gear to the slope. Um, the elbow. I'm not gonna want a downwards tube. Now, this music is slightly getting on my nerves. I'm gonna turn it down a bit. Alright, so we're going to want to add those. And then... Mm -hmm. we add these two elbows. Whoops, wrong way. Add these. That and that works good enough. All right, we're gonna want a tail fin. So, big question here: Should we control the yaw with a propeller heater or a an engine down here? No, I've never done an engine down there, so I think I'm gonna do that. Let's check if that works already. Indeed it does. Yeah, that needs some tuning down, like a lot. Speed... Uh, 1.75. Alright, a successful first test of that. Didn't do much because we were on the ground. So, the same. Now, roll control. That's gonna be important. So, we're going to want to put an engine there. And also, I should probably change. You know what I shouldn't do, actually? Actually. Okay, yeah, I'm gonna have auto-fixing roll, but only gonna have pitch and yaw, because that's, I think, how a normal helicopter works. Um, yeah, you don't really want to roll a helicopter at all, so what was that sound? It's just a little beep beeping. I guess that's just the sound it makes when you place a sensor somewhere, or just 
interact change a sensor at all okay fine by me so first we're gonna want to set it to what does it have to be attached for me to set it to use that okay it does it's annoying okay so I'm gonna want to do that Negative 180. Gonna want to set that to negative 270. What? Wait, what? Am I doing this wrong? Yeah, no. Uh, okay, no, just 270. And then we're gonna fine tune it down to 340. Slap that bad boy in there. And let's put on some blades and get a first flight. Okay, okay. One thing I forgot to do, take out the controls there. It's supposed to automatically do that. Okay, I don't think that's working just yet, but first of all, we definitely need some more weight in the front. And you know how we get weight in front? Okay. Okay, maybe we have to do something a little less than that. What's something we could do? That? Nope, too big. Also, I don't think that would really fit a helicopter. Just putting a wheel on the front of a helicopter. Ah. Um... I mean, we could do a different seat. Yeah, there's not really a wide range of seats. Maybe I could uh, activate mods. Lock editor. There we go. So now I should be able to, yes, change the weight of anything. So let's get a, uh, where is it, balance, heavy, uh, just a weight block in here, and change that to, why are you not selected, there we go, change that to, oh, wrong thing again, ah, come on, okay, change that to 2.5, sure, why not, does that work, nope, too heavy. Um, 1.5? Oh wait, that says B in it. It's not such a- oh wait, it just fixed itself. Okay, a bit too heavy. How about... 1.3? Nope, still just a bit too heavy. One point two. We're going to keep on subtracting tenths until we get this dang thing to work. Or possibly just one. Oh my gosh. It's almost perfect. Also, I think I need to set the output of this thing to negative one. That way it actually works how it's supposed to. Yep, seems to be self-adjusting now. Uh, maybe not. Also, maybe we need to make that 1.1. Um, I might have just actually completely destroyed that roll control. Maybe it actually needs to just be one. Oh no, it's not actually roll control, it's automatic roll adjusting. Adjusting. Okay, actually, no, this actually needed to be more heavy. Let's make it 1.6. Not 0.16, no, 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 no. There we go. Uh, 
Um. Hey, roll control, buddy. You okay? Yeah, actually, it really needs to be the other way. It actually had to be negative one. I was wrong. Of course I was. I'm dumb. Just kidding. Okay. So... Maybe we should actually set this to negative point five. Because it's getting a bit too aggressive. Alright. Okay, let's actually check the weight. Nope, maybe I should set it to two. Alright, we're going up by- what? What? I said it to two! Not six. Okay, as I was saying, we're gonna go up by in- by- by point two each time. What is wrong with the roll control? Okay, let's do a test and watch how this turns. Uh, what is up with this roll control? Helicopters are really hard to build. At least so I think. Also, maybe I should do it to all blades. Max blades, go! Uh, oh, we're alive. Did this thing get us back on our feet? Just a second. It's going in the wrong direction, I think. Okay, let's go to point five. Uh, oh wow. Ouch. Let's go back. Why? Why do you keep going back to the stupid thing? Come on. 2.6. Sure. Oh my gosh. Well, guess we're not building a helicopter today. I'll give up on that. Let's just look at my old Apache helicopter, and then mess with some gravity. This Apache helicopter is like, its thrust is super weak. It's just, see, it can, it's super slow, can barely get itself off, itself off the ground. But what I was going for is realism. That doesn't matter. Uh, oh. Ow. Ouchie, ouchie. Turn off that. Turn on the gravity mod. Hello, gravity. Did I just see something fly up into the sky? Okay, then. How about we make gravity five? Is that gravity? Yep, this thing has become much more usable. Amazing. Except it still, uh, doesn't work too well. Let's set this to moon gravity. I know that the gravity of the moon is about one-third of the Earth's gravity. And 
default gravity here is 10, and one third of 10 is 3.3333333, infinite threes. So, this is what it would be like to fly a helicopter on Mars. That is, if Mars, I mean, the moon. That is, if the moon had an atmosphere. Yeah, uh, pretty much all flying vehicles rely on having, um, the, on, on the, on there being an atmosphere. That's pretty important. Hello. Except for rocket propulsion. That's kind of like, as far as I know, that's probably the only propulsion system that doesn't require an atmosphere that we've come up with so far. All the other stuff, like helicopter blades, propellers, all that, it, yeah, it requires air. Uh, treasure hunt, here I come. Maybe. Yeah, no, probably not. I'm gonna room my way over here. Yee. 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 Oh. Yee. That didn't hurt nearly as much as I thought it would. Our vehicle, not me. Oh, there's actually, never mind. Whatever. Um, max speed. Oh my gosh, this thing actually whips it on, up into the air? Is that what's happening? Time go. Yeah, uh, yeah, that's insane. That's funny. That's very funny. So now that we've messed with gravity, okay, that reset gravity is not working. Maybe we should mess with building a hovercraft. Yeah, this video really doesn't have a purpose. Or maybe... A jet plane. Yeah, let's do a jet plane. Here we go. Put the cone on the front. Nose cone. Maybe I could... Yeah, so let's put the propeller there. Too bad the propellers don't have a speed changing thing. I think. Yeah, no, it doesn't. A simple vehicle. Why'd I do this? Why? <laughs> Why did I do that? That is very silly. Okay, um. Let's build the tiniest vehicle possible, and then we'll build a jet plane. The tiniest vehicle possible is, well, usable vehicle. You could just put one, you could just put down a seat. But this, I'm talking about actually usable vehicles. And yeah, the minimum is two blocks, because you have to have a seat and a form of propulsion. AKA a thing you sit on and a thing that makes you go. Hello. Aha. Okay, maybe the putting it back there wasn't a good idea. Vroom. Vroom. Vroom, vroom, vroom. Zoom. We be zooming. Okay, yeah, this doesn't have great control. Ow. Okay, now we build a propeller plane. And no, I was not doing some music with that 
propeller moving around. How about a biplane? Biplane would be fun. Okay, so what should be the connector? Well, obviously tubes. What else would we use? Other than the one by one blocks that should exist in this game. Yeah, really though, they should exist. Okay. Yep, now there's an even distance between them. So I cannot stand things not being, you know, consistent. That's the word, consistent. I cannot stand things not being consistent. So, we're going to put in some blocks there. Aerodynamics here. Can I, no, I can't put that there. The that that I'm referring to is putting aerodynamics there. Although I now have an idea. Maybe I could put the propellers like there. That's an idea. We would only need two T's to do that. Would we? Yes, yes we do. Like that. Copy that over to the other side. And bam. Now we got double the power. Oh wow, this is actually, it controls surprisingly well for how simple it is. I mean, no, not controls surprisingly well, it just flies surprisingly well. Although, man, I can actually feel that drag there. That drag coming from the front. That is just, oh, uh, wow. I feel like t gravity is still set to low. Like, huh? How am I just, how am I falling so slowly? No, I'm not even falling, I'm going up. I'm going up, how? Guessing because of being very light and a lot of wings. Whatever, I don't care. Tailfin. That. There, we got a basic plane. Oh, wait, no. Gotta fix that drag problem. I really don't understand why these cones are inside the tube section. They should be under the aerodynamics section. Makes no sense. Oh. Okay. Okay then. Um, I do not like that. That was stalling, right? I already forgot. Okay. So we're gonna put in some rotating servos to control roll from the front. Yeah, that should work nicely, although maybe I should probably just uh, angle much less. That should, that might actually be enough, saying that it, yeah, it moves where the thrust is coming from, and we've got so many wings. Yep, that's actually perfect. The minimum is perfect. All right, one way we could get not stalling is putting wings back here, because that'll put lift it back. There we go, let me check the time, okay, that's fine, okay, so, put those in. That would be W and S. S W. Yep, gotta turn down the angle though. Um, 25 degrees? Sure, why not? 
bam, bam. All right, aerodynamics not looking too bad so far, but we have a couple weak spots. So let's fix those up. Like that. Ooh, what if I do that? Even better. Perhaps I could get rid of those. And put a, uh, well, and press the Z there. And maybe even put a weight block back there to balance it. Is that gonna work? Don't tell me that's gonna work. It might just work. But I don't know, let's test it. How are we going to fix that while make, keeping a smooth look? Hmm. I really wish there were like these. So we could do that, but there were wedges. I mean, we already have that actually. But I need ones that could fit in like there. That would be great. So, like that. Ah. Or like that. I think like this. Alright, let's test this thing out. We're still too heavy on the back? How? Almost all the weight is concentrated up at the front. We got the seat at the front, we got propulsion at the front, we got a, a weight block at the front, we got aerodynamics at the front, we got wings at the front. Is it just too much lift at the front? Maybe it's too much lift at the front. Alright, let's come in for a landing. Oh yeah, and wheels. Those are gonna be important. Ah, get better run. Bye. Yeah, some landing gear would be nice. Oh gosh, we're gonna collide with that wall. I want a proper landing. Uh, uh, good enough. Good enough for my standards. Okay. I need something that's like in between with these. Just wait. Maybe I have stuff here. 7.5 kilogram electromagnet. I mean, that would be pretty fun, but also a bit useless. Hmm. Bombs, perhaps? Perhaps? No. Well, maybe once we add the weight of the landing gear, it'll be fine. Let's use the straight suspension. And that, that'll add 5 kilograms to the front. Also taking away 0.2 kilograms from the aerodynamic blocks, so that's net 1.3 kilograms. That will probably help. Also, this will be the first biplane that I ever make. Nope, that's definitely not enough. Okay then. You force my hand. I have to put even more lift. I have to put lift at the back, lift on the front. Just so much lift. That's a lot of lift. Also, tell me in the comments below if you want some Portal videos or Portal 2, because that would be fun. I will admit that would be fun. Alright, this seems to be pretty stable now. Just tell me in the comments below. Do you want Portal? Or do you want Portal 2? Or do you want no Portal or no, and no Portal 2? Or do you want both? 
because if you want both, then that's too bad because I can really only keep up with one at the ti same time. So, I would have to finish the first one before we go on to a new one. Oh wow. Cool. Cool glitching ter terrain that's trying to spawn but doesn't really want to. Okay, maybe it's not enough roll, actually. How? How do you fall so well? How do these provide enough drift to just glide like this? How? Beautiful. That was beautiful. Okay. Wait, what was I about to do? Okay, yes, I was going to make these at a better angle. Fifteen. Much better. I see you, chicken! Let's save this. By plane. By. And. Ah, work in progress. This is definitely work in progress. Let's aim this thing at the chicken. And smash the chicken with a plane. Never mind. Let's smash the chicken with a car. By the way, this is the car that I built for the dethrone game mode. Well, no, not a game mode. It's just a game you can do in multiplayer, but... Whatever, I built this car for dethrone. Boosters, cannon, unnecessary stuff that's decorational, zoom, doop, doop. Now where in the world did that chicken go? I see you! I see ya! I see ya, buster! I see ya, buster! Oh gosh, this thing, this thing turns well on turning right, but not left. Okay, let's keep working on, whoa, wrong button. Let's keep working on this biplane. So, what is the current problem? Um, we do not appear to have a current problem other than speed. Yeah, um. I'm just gonna smash myself into the ground, or do a powered landing, I don't know, it's just, it would take so long for this plane to fall that height. Actually no, let's land down here. Come on. Yeah. What? Hey, hey, ah, uh, uh. Come on, come on, come on. Okay. What? What the? What just happened? It looks like almost only the seed exploded. What just happened? Okay then. That's all I've got to say. Okay then. Um. Let's make a hybrid of a jet plane and a propeller plane. This should, also, this should also probably help to level this plane off. Maybe too much. Yeah, now we're still stalling. The stall is strong with this one. Yeah, it really is though. Oh. Whoa, whoa, how am I managing this? Okay, um, I didn't think I'd get that far. Anyways, back to this. Maybe we should add some mini thrusters. Got an idea. Got a great idea. Although I'll probably regret saying that. Anyways, so, 
that's actually bad. Oh, wrong ledge. That's the right ledge. Cool, cool, cool. Okay. So. Uh, there we go. A biplane with jet engines. There's a lot of mini thrusters. It still likes to stall. Why you stall so much? Why you glide so much? How about we just yeet that out of existence? All right, and then we attach that. We copy flip that. And then we eat that over there. And now Cool, we should have less left less lift. We should have less lift. Whoa. Ow. That's all I gotta say, ow. I've got an idea. Down on me. zero points, lots of zeros. One, but there's definitely not enough gravity to hold this thing down. It's got way too much lift. How about 20 gravity, double gravity, double gravity versus a biplane? Yeah, yeah, no, this actually works quite well. Ow. Ow, 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 just ow. Just plain old ow. Um, gurgle, 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 blub. Rounds. Let's set this to uh, E. How you even in this world? You should be freaking phasing through the ground right now. Uh, there goes my frame rate. What is going on? Why is every part black? Ladies and gentlemen, we might have broken the broken the game. Not surprising, I've done that tons of times. Um, jeez. Can we leave build mode? Uh, I don't think we can. How about we reset gravity? Oh! I expected that. I actually did. Well, um, that seems like a good place to end off the video, so please consider liking and subscribing. I hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you next time.